As you can probably tell by now, this coal mine is pretty dangerous. Look at this poor guy who got smashed by big chunks of coal. He's obviously been dead for some time now because we can see some green bacterial growth starting to cover his abdomen. The bacteria on his abdomen should help you remember that E. coli can cause spontaneous bacterial peritonitis. This is an infection of the ascitic fluid within the abdomen and is commonly associated with cirrhosis. So guy with bacteria spontaneously growing over his abdomen for spontaneous bacterial peritonitis. Next, notice that we've shown a pipe extending from the ceiling down to the outhouse. This flimsy pipe has been acting as a support pillar for the mine until recently when it caught on fire. The fire weakened the support of the pillar, which caused the ceiling to collapse and is responsible for this chaotic scene. The pillar idea should help you think of pili. The pipe going to the outhouse kind of resembles the kidneys, ureters, and bladder going to the urethra. The fact that the pipe is on fire should help you think of inflammation. So putting these ideas together should help you remember that E. coli has virulent pili that are associated with UTIs, cystitis, and pyelonephritis. The reason the pipe caught on fire was because of these exposed wires hanging from the ceiling. These long, thin wires resemble fimbriae, so they're here to help you remember that E. coli has virulent fimbriae, which are also associated with cystitis and pyelonephritis. Okay, now notice that we've shown a picture of a girl on the outhouse. The guys that have been working in this mine are sleazebags, so they like to hang up pictures of prostitutes on the outhouse. Prostitute sounds like prostate, so this picture of the prostitute should help you remember that E. coli causes inflammation of the prostate, or prostatitis. The coal mine accident has been so bad that the military had to get involved. As you can see, this military guy is helping oversee some rescue efforts. He needs to use the restroom, so you can see him walking right next to the outhouse. Notice that he has an ammo belt strapped across his torso. Just like in our other images, the ammo belt is here to represent amoxicillin. The fact that it's right next to the outhouse should help you remember that amoxicillin can be used to treat E. coli urinary tract infections. 